playing at the University of Tennessee Martin, which is a Division I FCS school. He made a visit this last weekend and committed. We're really excited about him, too. Jake plays defensive end. We'll probably play defensive end, maybe linebacker when he gets to Angelo. Brandon is a safety, possible corner. It's like when you go and you report, they may recruit you in one position, but you may end up playing something else, too. So uh, they, they understand how that process works. Next to Brandon is Tapiwa Mudway. Tapiwa uh, moved in here two years ago and has been just a tremendous uh, guy, just a tremendous young man, not only in, in football, but also the kind of person he is. Uh, he's shown a lot of leadership. He and uh, Brandon were two of our captains this year. We're really excited about his opportunity to go on to Texas Lutheran in Seguin and play football there. Next to next to Tapiwa is, okay, it's Jack. Jack is <laughs> Now, let me tell you a funny story, okay? So, they're Kurt Singer products, right? So, I don't know, I've been here 12 years. I go down to the Kurt Singer and do all the, you know, watch them, talk every once in a while, go to the B classes. So, I go down there, I think we're in the third grade. I'm, I'm going to talk to the class about something, and everybody's sitting in their squad lines, right? One, one after the other. And I see these two big heads that are about this much taller than everybody else. And I'm thinking, who are those guys? And I really, at the time, never dreamed, I'm being serious, I never dreamed I would be around here long enough to ever see those guys graduate from Centennial High School. You just, you know, as a coach, you don't, you, you just don't plan too far ahead. You just take one year.